think it has something to do with how I'm feeling. How do you feel? I feel blessed. Pamela, what does blessed mean? Let's look in the dictionary. Here it is. The dictionary says that blessed is to make sacred or holy or to bring God's favour on a person or thing. Thanks for helping. What does blessed mean to you? To me, to be blessed means to get a gift from God or an opportunity that you've been given to do something wonderful. How have you been blessed? I've been blessed in lots of ways in my life. I've been blessed with my friends and my work colleagues and the opportunity to work here at St. Joseph's with my wonderful person reception. I've also been blessed at home with my family, with my wonderful husband and my lovely little boy. And I've been blessed very recently with the opportunity to have little twins as well. So I've been blessed in lots of ways in my life. What does bless mean to you? Bless means to me when you're given opportunities and I'm blessed because of my family and friends. I feel blessed because I have a nice school. What does bless mean to you? Bless means to me that I have a kind and caring family and that I've been given lots of teaching opportunities. Michael, what does bless means to you? Bless means to me when you are going to be part of God's family. Michael, have you been blessed? Uh, yes, with my family. Bless means to me when you have got a calling from God. How have you been blessed? I have been blessed with my family. Beatrice, what does bless mean to you? Blessed means to me when you go and see a member of my family again. Beatrice, when have you been blessed? I have been blessed by my family. When have you been blessed? When I'm at church. That's a lovely question. Bless means recognizing how God touches us in our lives. Touches us many times, touches us every day. We recognize God's blessing in the people that we share our lives with. The gifts that we enjoy personally as individuals. We're all of us very different people, we're all of us gifted individuals, and we recognize those gifts as God's gifts to us in our lives. So I recognize God's blessings and the skills that make me who I am, and also in the wonderful faces of the people that I interact with every day of my life, not least of all my own family. But with the people I'm privileged to share my life with in my ministry, not least of course the wonderful young people of St. Joseph's School. How do you feel you have been blessed? Well, Hannah, I've been blessed in so many ways through my life. I'm able to look back now to when I was your age. I had a, a lovely childhood with lovely parents and a lovely family. I have three younger brothers. They're all married men now and they have their own children. And I recognise God has blessed me and my family, my extended family. Every year I used to go to Ireland for my holidays to see my grandparents. A lovely, lovely childhood. And I've been very fortunate. I had a great education and I recognise that in my career I, I worked for a trade union uh, for a lot of years. But then the greatest blessing have to say is becoming a priest. It took me a long time to realise that, that God was cheerfully calling me to be a priest and that has been a wonderful blessing in my life to go to Rome and to study to be a priest and so far now I've had nearly 17 years of priesthood 
interacting with the most beautiful people every day of my life. And do you know the wonderful thing about being a Christian is that every day somebody says thank you to me. It's a great, great blessing to realise that you affect people's lives in so many ways and to be appreciated. Do you know one of the most wonderful things we can do every day of our lives on earth is just to say thank you. Thank you to those who do so much for us, who give us so much. But I'm grateful for the blessings I've enjoyed in my life. I'm blessed to be a priest, blessed in my life, blessed in all the people that I interact with every day of my life. It's, uh, I recognize my blessings and I thank God every day for the wonderful blessings that I enjoy. This week's scripture is from Jeremiah 17, verse 7. This scripture means that if you put all your faith and trust in God, you will be forever blessed. This links to our mission statement by being trusting in God, we are blessed with our gifts and talents, which means we can create a better tomorrow. The priest blesses us at different times in our lives. When we are baptised and confirmed, we receive a blessing by the priest in the form of the cross on the forehead. During marriage, the couple are blessed so that they can start their new life together with God by their sides. There are other times when the priest gives us a blessing, but during the consecration, the bread and wine are blessed and changed into the body and blood of Christ. To reflect this week, we would like you to pray the Holy Water Prayer. Sit for a few moments and think about how you are blessed. Say a thank you prayer to God. Next, put your thumb in the water and make a cross on the person's forehead next to you. Say the words, God bless you. Your mission is to stop throughout the week and think about all the blessings you have. Be thankful for everything and everyone around you.